So I am at main bus terminal of Abu Dhabi and from here I will catch bus for Dubai and yeah after that we will start our journey for off night campaigning in Dubai desert and which desert I will tell you okay so I have bought tickets okay this is the bus which I will board for Dubai Friends, uh, you can see that's the place too far where you can see the trees. That's the mangrove forest where I did the kayaking, right? I have uploaded the video. You can check it out. Friends, that's the Al Raha Mall, which is very beautifully constructed in round shape. The view is really very beautiful from here. I hope you also experience it. So we have reached Ibn Battuta Mall and from here we will take the metro. Okay. So we are going to the Everest Mall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You are also going. Okay. Come. That's the metro station. So you can see that this metro has been driven by a computerized system and nobody drives it. It's an automatic. Wow. Amazing view, nice construction. I have reached Emirates Mall, Dubai. Here I will gather with my group members, which are around 30 to 40. And we will go to Al Qudra Desert. Yeah, that's the desert name. And over there, we will have lots of activities. And before going there, I will have a lunch. And you guys stay tuned for activities coming up. So, today we will start at 3 o'clock and we will go to Al Qudra Desert where we will, we will do our BBQ bonfire and we will spend whole night over there and yes for that i will be covering one video on this so stay tuned it's two o'clock guys i'm very much hungry in mall of emirates you will find multiple options to have a food but i like indian food so i will prefer bombay chapati you have multiple options here you get almost every food of north indian dish here Bhaji, Chole Bhature, everything except South Indian. That Gulab Jamun, my favorite. So I will enjoy my food. You stay tuned. So I have completed my lunch. Yeah, right? and now I am heading towards the fourth level D entrance because earlier when I went, nobody was there. Now everyone has come there, so I will go. 
and we will start our journey. We are all here and we will start now. Here we go guys, we are now heading towards the Al Qudra Desert. I am with my friend and member Farooq. Hi. Yes, we all are 40 to 30 members and all are coming by their cars and yes, we will go there and we will gather at Al Qudra cycling point. Al Qudra is also known for its cycling track in the way. Yes, it has 86 kilometers long cycling track where people are coming there for cycling. We are now entering Al Qudra cycling point and we are now on Al Qudra road. Friends, here you get an option to get the cycle on rental basis. So if you come here, you can get the cycle on rental basis and you can enjoy the cycling if you like. Last exit. Yes, okay. So here the Al Qudra. Friends, I forgot to mention that this Al Qudra desert is near the Dubai only. From all of Emirates, it's around 50 kilometers. So you can hire a car, you can, if you have own car, you can come and you can enjoy the dunes of desert at Al Qudra. You can see the view, it's very beautiful. If you like it, please hit the like button. Okay guys, so we have reached the Al Qudra cycling point. So this is our meeting point. These are all our group members. <laughs> this is the Al Qudra cycling point. Alright, so we started at Mall of Emirates Dubai and we drive till Al Qudra cycling track and now we are heading towards the Al Qudra desert. Over there we will park the small cars and we will go in 4x4 SUVs. Right? Right. <laughs> Dubai is only developed uh, apart from Other all the Emirates. seven Emirates. Right? Yeah. There are total seven Emirates. Seven Emirates. Only Dubai is... Yeah. Too much developed. Yeah. And still developing. Still developing, <laughs> yes. Really. Yeah. Car here. This is all our group members' car. From here, we will take the SUVs 4x4. And we will go in that. We are ensuring the tire pressure needs to be correct as per the criteria when you drive the car inside the desert. Right, right now the tire pressures are normal between the range of 25 to 30 which is being used for driving car on the roadside. But when you drive car inside the desert, you need to make sure that your tire pressure has to be between 10 psi to 15 psi depending on the car. Right, so we are releasing the excessive pressures from all the four tires of the car. We are all group members. Oh, we are starting from here to Al Qudra Desert. Yeah. Right? I am with Matt and Usman and Sabrina. Sabrina. So nice, amazing, dunes of deserts are really nice, wow amazing, our driver is very safe, his name is Matt and he's from Europe, he drives car really very safely, not like that you see in the video, <laughs> but I, I want to experience that too also.
Bravo, Matty! Bravo! Bravo. Yeah. Yeah. Nice match! That was my first drive in the desert in which I did I know, it seems like a big side move. So these are all of our group members. Hello! Hi! What's your name? Ahmed. Ahmed Kunal. <laughs> What's his name? Bonjo. Nice name. Hello, Bonjo. What is it? He's so cute. Hello. What is his name? Okay, a girl. I mean, nice. These are some.